the first thing that you're going to do is open up a program like Paint or any program that will make a picture. This white box here is going to be our background, so we're going to resize it to the correct size. Uncheck Maintain Aspect Ratio, Pixels. Our main is 800 by 450. So 800 across, 450 up and down, that's our main size. So that's going to give us our main box. What we're going to do now is we're just going to save that box. So we'll save that as frame 1, frame 1, 800 by 450. And we do want to save it as a JPEG. So we'll save that. And I already made one, so I'm replacing it. The next thing we're going to we're going to resize it again. Uncheck that. And we're going to go exactly half that. So 400. Oops, 400 by 225 pixels across. OK, and we're going to save this. And we're going to save this one as frame 2. And we want to mark this one 450 by 225. And we are. I'm going to overwrite that. So that's our two sizes. Now, when we open Paint, and we're going to open our large one, our 800 by 450. This is going to be a background. We're going to open a second version of Paint so that we've got two of them. And on this one, we're going to open up one of the pictures that we want to use. Now, this picture is 384 by 425. And you can see, if we put this picture inside this box, it's going to be way too small. So on this one, we want to open up our smaller frame. Now you can see that when we put this picture in this box, it should be just about right. So we do Control-All to select it. We do Control-C to copy it. We come over here. We do Control-V to paste it. And you can see that that picture fits up and down just about exactly inside the box. So you just kind of center it in there, come in do a save as we'll call this breast cancer dot jpeg and we'll save that so now let's say that we've got a picture that's bigger than that so we're going to come in here we're going to open up our large frame we're going to open up our second version of paint and we want to open again and now we've got a picture that's 617 across and 463 up and down. So you can see this picture is just, a, it's actually a little bit bigger than our frame box here. Um, it's wide enough because it's 617 and our frame box here is 800, but it's actually a little bit too tall. What we can do is we can resize this picture. So we can come in here and we do want to maintain the aspect. And so we're going to come into pixels and it has to be at least less than 450 or 450 exactly. That changes our horizontal to 599. That we do Control A to copy. We come over here. We do Control. Whoops. We do Control All. Control A for all. Control C for copy. Come over here. Control V for paste. And you can see that that's going to fit inside there. You can see that other picture behind it. Let's get rid of that. So we paste it in. Now it's going to be exactly the right size. We come over here. We save it. We'll save this one as jet. And it's now the right size dot JPEG. Now you've got two pictures that are exactly the right size for putting inside your boxes. Let me show you one of the ways where this comes in handiest. We won't save that. We'll open up Paint, and we're going to need our small box. We we'll come in here to 400 to 25. We're going to open up our second version of Paint. We're going to come in here, and we're going to open up this picture. This picture is 151. It's 151 tall, so it's a little taller than than our than than our box. And it's 245, uh, it's 151 across and 245 up and down. So we're going to resize this. 
our up and down pictures pixels have to be 225. It's going to make it 138. There we go. Do control A for all, control C for copy. Come over here, do control V for paste. And you can see that that picture is going to fit inside our box. We're going to save it again. Save as man face. JPEG. Now, when we go to pull this picture inside one of our news themes, you're going to see the white part of the box, but that's okay. 